I'm doing this test on the lowest end Surface Pro 4. It's not really the most powerful computer, but it'll do if we keep everything side by side. You can get the 4.0 Pre-Alpha 2 version from the Krita.org website. Their latest news post gives a rundown on a lot of things that are planned for 4.0. Near the bottom of the page, you can find the link to download it. And of course, you can get the normal, stable 3.3 version from the download area. For the test, I just went through different brushes and sizes and recorded the difference. I usually waited until the strokes were finished before switching between 3.3 and 4.0. I didn't want both versions working at the same time as my computer didn't really do too great trying to process everything. The biggest improvements to performance will only happen with brushes in the pixel engine category. You can tell what engine your brush is in by opening the brush editor. In 3.3, the brush engine names are listed on the left-hand side. In 4.0, the brush engine is listed to the right of the brush preview area under the name. All these pixel engine brushes are using multiple cores to do their rendering in 4.0. They will have significant speedups. It's possible to that other brush engines can have this in the future, but the developers have to get some other features ready before 4.0 is released. Some brushes, like the smudge brushes, can be especially slow at large sizes. There isn't a very big difference between 3.3 and 4.0. The last part of the video shows another speed up that has been around a while but can and can really speed things up if you need to work big. It is called Instant Preview and can be turned on from the view menu. It might slow down your computer a bit with small brushes, so I usually just leave it off unless I am working really big. This instant preview feature will work for all brush engines. You will also need OpenGL on for it to work as it requires your graphics card.